Whoa, guys, what is this? It looks like some sort of surprise bag. Let's look on the other side. It says Pequipi. I wonder what that means. There are one, two, three different surprises inside. Which one should we try? I'll pick this one. Whoa, what is this? I wonder what's inside. Let's see. Whoa, it says handmade with love. I know what this is. It's a peek with peek quiet book. Let's see what's inside this pocket here. Whoa, it comes with a bunch of letters. That means we can name it whatever we like. Let's name it Christmas book. C H R I S T M A S B O O K spells Christmas book. And it has a cool pocket here where we can put our own picture. I think we'll put a picture of Genevieve since this is going to be Genevieve's Christmas book. Here's our school picture. I'll just slide it in here. Let's open it by undoing this button here. And see what's inside the first page. First, it looks like the skier needs help getting down the slope. Here's the path the skier took, but it's all a mess. We need to straighten it out. I'll just pull it through all these loops here, and we can redo it in order. There, let's take the path and make it zigzag through the numbers. One. Two. Let's make sure to pull it tight. Three. Four. Five. This is kind of like lacing your shoes. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, and last one, ten. Now it zigzags one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, down the slope, just like the skier. Now let's do the second page. This one has a snowman, and he's got a cute little bird perched on his twiggy hand. It comes with a small snowball and a big one. Where do you think they go? If we put the small one here, it's not big enough. And if we put the big one here, it's too big. So maybe we can switch them. Let's put the small one right there and the big one right there. Now look at our snowman. He's perfect. Good job. Let's turn the page and see what's next. First, we have a mom and daughter and they're baking cookies. We need to put the cookies where the shapes are. Luckily, the cookies come with the book. Let's see. This one is the shape of a house, so let's put it over here in the house shape. Now, let's try this one. This is a gingerbread man. He should go right here. What shape is this? It's a crescent, just like the moon some nights. Let's put it right there in the crescent cutout. We have three more delicious cookies. I want to do the heart. Here it is. Let's see, the heart should go right there. Last two, here's the bell. The bell should go right here between the gingerbread man and the crescent moon. Our last cookie is a twinkling star. Let's put it right there. Good job, now we can bake some cookies with the mommy and her daughter. The next page has a cool stocking that's blue and has a reindeer on it and it's right in front of a crackling fire. But there are no presents inside. We'll get to that in just a minute. But for now, let's turn the page and try the next activity. Whoa, look, it's a hockey game. Hockey is a cool game to play in the winter because you skate on ice. A few of our players are on the sidelines, but they would like to play too. This one is a hockey player for the red team. Let's put him with his red teammates. And what about this one? He looks different from the other players. He has a mask. That means he is a goalie and he helps protect the net. And he's on the blue team. So let's put him over here in front of the net for the blue team. There he goes. What about this one? He plays on the blue team, but he doesn't have the face mask. So he's just a regular player and he goes with the rest of his teammates. 
Oh look, we have another goalie. This one has a face mask, but he's on the red team. That means he goes over here in front of this net. Now, what do we need to play hockey? Well, you don't play hockey with the ball. You play hockey with the puck, which is a little black disc. Let's put it in the middle and let them play. Let's see what's on the next page. Whoa, it's Santa Claus and his reindeer. And he's got a harness to mush him along. And here's Santa Claus and his sack full of presents. Hey, that gives me an idea. We can take these presents and put them in the stocking we found earlier. Let's go back. Here's our stocking. It needs some presents because it's empty. So let's use these. This present is purple. This present is tall and green. This present is blue. This present is orange. Here's another blue present. And our last present is a really big red present with yellow stars. Wow, look, now our stocking is full of presents and ready for Christmas. Let's go back over here and see what's next. Oh wow, it's a Christmas tree and a gingerbread puzzle. First, let's decorate our Christmas tree. It has these lights that we need to string together to decorate it. First, let's zigzag it through the colored hoops. Green, red, pink, clear, yellow, and blue. Look at our lights. They go around and around the Christmas tree. Even though our Christmas tree has lights on it, it's still missing something. Hmm, I know what it needs. It needs ornaments. This ornament is red. Let's stick it here. Now let's add a yellow ornament. Do you know what color this is? Green. That's right, it's green. How about this one? Blue. It's blue, good job. And now an orange one. And finally, let's add a brown ornament at the top. That's better, our tree is beautiful and ready for Christmas. Wait, what's this? There's a package here with something inside. <gasps> it's a teddy bear. Oh, it's so cute. And wait a minute, there's something else inside. It's a teddy bear in a box. How cute. Look at them. Let's put them under the tree. Now let's look at the gingerbread house. Look, it's a puzzle that we can put together. Here's the door. Let's stick it right here. And the chimney should go right there. And our last piece is the top of the roof. Here's a look at our finished gingerbread house. It looks so delicious. That's the last page of our Peek with Peek Quiet book. Let's close it up. And slide it back in his package so we can surprise Genevieve with it when she finds it. All right guys, make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you like this book. And remember, we've still got two more surprises to open, so make sure you subscribe to see what they are. Bye.